Here at PMC, we've been hard at work with exciting and meaningful projects like the ABCs of Abolition, the Education and Equity Panel Discussion, and Portland Rising's City Council Panel. These projects allow the public's voice to be heard and help PMC achieve our mission. Let's begin with some exciting news for November, and who better to kick things off with than Derry Runlet and his new show. Derry Runlet is back with the latest edition of the Derry Runlet Show. This time around, Derry interviews local Maine celebrity Ed Romanoff. You may know Ed from the audiobooks, songs, performances, and dance numbers. Starting off as a child on The Ken McKenzie Show, Ed graduated to Broadway actor in no time, landing supporting roles in dozens of plays, musicals, and television shows during his long and successful career. We are so honored to have this Broadway icon step onto the stage of The Derry Runlet Show and tell his story. Watch the Dairy Run the Show on Channel 5 or on Portland Media's YouTube channel. Next, let's talk about PMC's new board of directors. We at PMC are happy to welcome four new board members. These board members include Anella Linton, Development Director at WMPG, Jerry Edwards, Co-Director and Collaboration Manager of Black Owned Maine, as well as longtime member of PMC and our resident IT guy, Ray Tiley. And joining this all-star cast of board members is co-founder of Visual Integrity and board member of the Maine Irish Heritage Center, Gene Haney. Learn more about PMC's board of directors by going to portlandmedia.org slash our board. Next up, Luigi Carcelli and his new show, Friday Night Matters. PMC is happy to welcome Luigi Carcelli and his new show, Friday Night Matters, a half-hour show interviewing local Maine artists, comedians, and filmmakers. This week, Luigi interviews comedian Marcus Cardona on his sold-out show at Thompson's Point, Cabin Fever. We also get to hear a live performance from rapper-slash-poet Miles Bullen. So watch Friday Night Matters, 8 p.m. Eastern, on Channel 5, or keep an eye out on PMC's YouTube channel for when it comes out later this month. Now let's talk about Africans United of New England. In the current edition of Africans United, Ann Smith interviews a local businessman with a very unique mission. Lawrence Akeo, originally from Kenya, immigrated to the United States to seek higher education and become an ordained minister. Mr. Okeo's ultimate goal was to serve others, and he found out how to fulfill this by helping African refugees navigate the complicated institution that is the Internal Revenue Service. While he handles the tax accounts of these refugees, he also provides moral and ethical help when they need it, making sure that they can find success in this confusing world. Finally, let's talk about freedom and captivity and the ABCs of abolition. PMC has been a community sponsor of the statewide Freedom and Captivity Project, and one of the projects PMC has helped create is the ABCs of abolition. Local Maine residents were asked to suggest words that captured their vision of abolition that is, finding alternatives to incarceration, and what it means to them. The ABCs of Abolition showcases their words and interpretations, offering a hopeful and compelling portrait of the way Maine could be. The Freedom and Captivity Project would like to invite you to join them in imagining a different, better future. Watch the ABCs of Abolition by going to Portland Media Center on YouTube. It's amazing to see so many exciting projects happening at PMC this month. PMC has always been about inspiring media in the greater Portland area, and I'm so happy to see so many creative minds at PMC this November. Join us next month with more exciting announcements. Until then, stay warm, stay safe, and keep creating. Good, fine. And stumble, did I? Did I stumble on anything? Do you think we should do another did take? Or we do? You do one more take? Yeah. Let's do one more take. Like the last three seconds, just you were like.
seems like you were trying to catch up.